Brian here this morning with Hollis Farms. Came down early, did a little, tried to do a little pig hunt this morning. Nothing was moving, so we got some plenty of tractor work to do. We're gonna go over to the uh, one of the farms here and use this do all behind this John Deere. I believe we're in the 7210. I didn't even look at it, see what tractor I'm on. But anyway, we're gonna ride over there and turn in, turn some of this chicken litter under that we got put out yesterday. So you'll see that implement back there behind us. We'll get a little better ca camera angle when we get over and show you how that thing turns into soil. this do all ready to go here I gotta show you we're gonna we got to uh, got to pull the pins on these wings right here let's see I have one on the other side this is the only one is pinned but put this pin in here so it won't uh, be so much stress on these cylinders when we're riding down the road but anyway we'll get up here and get in the track and get this thing opened up you see how it works Uh, you can see it work here in a minute. It's got rotary blades on the front there to help chop the dirt. Then it's got a row of spike, kind of floating spikes there in the middle that'll help bust the clods. And on the very back, it's got a, a board that levels the dirt. So, I'll kind of show you how it works here in a minute. We'll get it turned around here and show you what the fields look like before we run over them, and then show you what it looks like afterwards. See if I can show you the difference here. I'll get to some good, a little better camera angle in a minute, but you can see right here, I already made one pass on that front first row right there. It levels it, bust up a lot of the bigger clods. You can move right here. You can see where I hadn't been. You can see the difference, still got ruts from the disc. So we can make a couple of more passes. I'll kind of show you what this field looks like when we finish up. another field I want to jump off the tractor right here and kind of show you a little bit closer look at this do all it's kind of hard for me to do much video and I hadn't got a mount from a camera with me but you can see here this field while the field had been disc up a couple times it was uh, of course after you disc it with the plow it's got ruts and whatnot clods as you can see this do all bust all the clods up levels it up no more ruts ready to plant so I'll show you this uh, show you a little bit more about this machine up close got these rotary ch chopping blades on the front here you'll see they spin they, they'll bust those quads and then you've got the series of, of uh, spikes here that kind of float along the ground those help kind of level out any high spots low spots you might have either and at the very back, you've got these boards that are, uh, you can set the tension on those and drag the field, kind of drags it down smooth. But it does a really good job. You can see this field here went from pretty rough and plowed up in two passes. It got it down smooth. So anyway, first time I think we've had this machine on the video. So I'm going to go hit a couple more fields here. got those sides uh the wings put up there I, i'll show you how they go up down in a minute we got them 
that'll fold it up so we can go on to the next field. We'll be right back. All right, we made it to the second field and we'll get these uh, wings down right here and I'll, I'll show you how that works a little bit. Just got to, uh, just like a bat wing bush hog, got a uh, set of cylinders there that uh, lay those wings out there, you'll see. those down ready to go I'll show you this field right here this is kind of a it's not a new food plot but we've kind of expanded it you can see we've been doing a little dozer work over there and got a new uh got a new ranch king blind up right there but you can kind of see this field's got a lot of ruts in it from the tractor but you'll see i'll go over this thing several times and i'll show you what it looks like when we get through uh, and the dozer and got the d5 sitting right here we're doing a little work with it got the root rake on it and turn this run over this field a couple times I'll show you what it looks like when we're through here a second this kind of gives you a little bit of idea of how much good this machine does you can see right here I made a couple of passes hardly any ruts left smooth and then over here you see where the disc is run the lime wagon was run over you can see the tracks there so then you can get right over here you can see what I've already made run over with the do off so this machine saves us a lot of passes two passes go slow be easy on the tractor it levels it right on up out good there that field was pretty rough with a lot of grass in it that thing chops up all the clods knocks them busts them up and then drags it smooth got that one done we'll go do another one
got that big field finished up. We got uh, two more small food plots to do, so we we headed that way. I'll uh, get off here a little bit and show you a little bit more about this machine. Maybe we can get a little video of it close up running. We'll be right back. Got we'll get these fields done. Okay, we made it to the last food plot that I got to get done today. You can see the do all back there. Lowered it down one last time and. Get this done for the day. Trying to time to go find something to eat. Been on this tractor now for about four hours. So get this little food plot done here. I'll show you one more time when we get through. This field's pretty pretty good shape already, but this do all uh, the level it right on up and get it ready to plant. But uh, appreciate y'all riding with us today. I'll hop off here when I get through and give you a little walk around this tractor one more time and. Uh, if you like what we do, subscribe. It's uh, Hollis Farms. Thank y'all. Finished up that field. That one, that one leveled up real, real good. You can see here the, the job that machine does. It make it real easy. We we'll get ready to plant it. A good, be a pretty, pretty food plot. So we'll, uh, maybe we'll, maybe we can look up, hunt that stand right there, and get a get some hunting video this year. But again, appreciate y'all watching. And uh, may, this might be the only time we get on this tractor with the do all this year. But. It's a heck of a machine. Hope you enjoy watching that.